Hi. Hi. Today we're with the two of us. Um, I'm helping Nino and tell you already. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna make some gemstone soap. Do it yourself. I found some ideas on Pinterest uh, from gemstone soap and I want to make it like a gift and give it to uh, our, yeah, our family and friends for the holidays. So I really like this gift idea. And this is what my reference is. I will post a photo also in the description. And yes, we're gonna try to make it and it will be beautiful. When you told me the idea, I was like, that's a good idea, you know? Yeah, that's one of the good ideas that you have. <laughs> I think it will be really eye-catching in your bathroom. So and when people who walk in, they will see the gemstone soap and they will be like, whoa, it's good. <laughs> and they won't know what it is until they realize it's so. All right, yeah. have fun watching, bye. bye. In this video, I will be only making three soaps because otherwise the video will be way too long. And I will start by making this pink colored one and to the left the pink flat one. By the way, I will link down everything you need to make this soap into the description bar. Cutting the soap was so much fun. So put the soap in a bowl and microwave it. Uh, on the package of the soap base you will read the direction on how to microwave it. So basically what I did was I poured in a layer of colored soap and then I let it dry and then poured in another color of layered soap. So you will have like um, all layers of soap and when you cut it, it will end up like this. Yeah, one word of caution, don't pour in too hot of the soap base because uh, like you saw in the video, it almost melted my plastic bottle, so watch out for that and let it cool down a little bit before you pour in. I was really surprised of how quick the soap dried and when it dries you can immediately cut it into the shape you want. Don't throw away the soap uh, parts you uh, cut off because you can reuse them. I didn't really like the bottom part of the soap so I cut it off and I also cut it into soap. So I cut off uh, the top flat and then I cut off the sides. The second soap, the process will be a little bit different. It's this blue one. You won't be making layers with the soap. You will just pour everything you have, every color you make into one bottle and try to make it really light color, like pastel colors. So don't for, wait for it to dry and just pour in everything. Also with this yellow one, try to make a dripping effect so that it won't mix in with the rest of the colors.
So you can see here when you cut it, you will see the different colors through it because you didn't mix it completely. So you will see a lot of color dimension. Look how beautiful this is. Oh my God. I really like how this one turned out. It's so beautiful. So I will be also making a part two where I show you how to make the other gemstone soaps. So yeah, also check out part two of this video and I hope you thought the gemstone soaps were beautiful because I really thought they turned out really great. So yes, watch part two. I'll see you soon.